iPad is a product that was brought out by Apple. And basically what this is, is it's a computer in tablet form. And what this means for students is, now when a teacher gives them a topic or a research paper or any other kind of classroom related thing, they can do it within the classroom or take it home with them and research it at home if they don't have a computer. This is great because now teachers don't have to schedule for the library, they don't have to send students home hoping that they have a computer of their own, and now students are able to progress technologically. Now these iPads allow students to get on the internet, download apps, as well as take notes. Now, every classroom that got them last year, which is the total of four, every teacher said that it was a huge success. What's even better is, next year, every student at LHS is going to have an iPad of their own. Hi, I'm Jack Greathouse, principal at Lancaster High School. As you know, we are really excited about the direction that this high school is going as far as our academic standing, our excellent rating, all the great things that we're doing. And what we're really excited about starting next school year is the implementation of iPads, our one-to-one -one learning environment and culture that we have developed here at Lancaster High School. A few years ago, at the State of the Schools address, I came on with a teacher, Kelly Marvin. We talked about how we need to go forward with technology. Well, as you've heard and will hear from Mr. Matchett, Dean of Students here at Lancaster High School, who has headed up the iPad committee, and of course, Mr. Conrad, uh, Assistant Principal here at Lancaster High School. It is just a, it's an amazing process that kids can benefit as they learn. But there are some things that we have to be aware of. Parents, students, you need to understand that these iPads, it's like a mobile textbook. It still belongs to the district. You, you can use them. We want you to, to learn, be creative, do all the wonderful things that they are meant to be used for. However, I have to remind you that it's still school property. We want you to be safe with them. We, we want you to do the right kinds of things and enhance your learning so that you are college and career ready because that's the goal here at Lancaster High School to make sure that every student that walks through the graduation gets that diploma that they are in fact college and career ready. You have to be safe with these iPads. You have to be careful with them. It's a very expensive device and it's one that could be very costly. You, you don't want to lose them. You want to make sure you're always taking care of them. We're going to have people that are going to do their best to help fix them if something goes wrong. It's not a perfect solution. And it's not a perfect, in, in no way is iPad technology perfect, but it is exciting and it can be very rewarding. We want you to be safe. We want you to be careful. And we want you to remember that it's the districts and again let's have fun while we're learning as we continue to be a school that is known for its academic excellence. Again thanks a lot and we really appreciate all the great work that Kevin Snyder and, and all of the, the district has provided, the support, the Board of Education. It, it, it's been a tremendous undertaking through a lot of people and we really really appreciate their help and again, let's make Lancaster High School, as it always is, the best. Thanks a lot. We're excited for next school year to bring iPads to the uh, students at Lancaster High School. We, w we really want to bring in that 21st century learning to our uh, students here at Lancaster High School to, to help make them be more creative, innovative, uh, more problem solvers, and also uh, incorporate more of a collaborative environment to our uh, students here at Lancaster High School with those iPads. Uh, a couple of the goals we do have with the iPads that we've researched and found that uh, we feel that bring a benefit to the students. It does increase student achievement. That's our first goal. Of course, we want to increase uh, student learning within the classroom. We also want to connect that link from home and school. We feel that by allowing students to have iPads here at school and the ability for them to take those home it allows them to have that link between home and school and to be able to connect with their teachers and also their course content a little bit better. 
And of course, here at Lancaster High School, we also want to provide a high quality education for all of our students. My name is Scott Matchett. I'm a Dean of Students at Lancaster High School. The idea of Lancaster High School going one to one with iPads began a few years ago uh, when four teachers and a couple administrators went together and wrote the ETech Ohio grant, which we were rewarded and received uh, $100,000. And with that, they bought four I iPad carts as well as MacBooks to begin the process of implementing iPads into the classroom. Uh, the teachers, Ms. Marvin, Ms. G Mr. Gillespie, Ms. Rooker, and Ms. Henderson, they went through extensive training provided by the state of Ohio on how to implement technology into the classroom. Uh, they soon saw the impact technology had on the kids in terms of excitement for learning and also the 21st century skills that they are going to need for the future. Uh, with that success, uh, Kevin Snyder, Director of Technology at Lancaster with the Lancaster City Schools, uh, decided that we need to start the process of implementing iPads for all students. The staff was bought iPads at the end of the school year last year, and this year they're currently going through extensive training so they can begin to implement them into the classroom and curriculum and help students with the implementation next school year.